today, today's a special one. Come on. This is going to be a quick in and out. We have that Mexican OT. Make some noise. We have that Mexican OT in the building today. Come on. What's up, baby? What's up? What's up? What's up? Man. Bro, you're from a part of Texas. I know I know Houston pretty well. I don't really know Bay City. Yeah, it's like an hour and a half southeast. We in the country. Let's one time. Okay, okay. You're gonna have to tell me about it. Today, do you know the premise? Do you understand the score? I'm making it be in ten minutes. You do you. Yeah, come on. All right. How uh how are you feeling today though? What is your what what could I give you that you need? Man, just just give me something I could talk to, some player shit, you know, like something I can just, you know. That's all I need to know. Come on, you know what I'm That's saying. That's all I need to know. Come on now. I can't believe you're only 25 years old. Yeah. When, when did you start rapping? Like, when did you really take it serious? Like, like career-wise? Yeah. Like, about like two years ago. Two years ago? Yeah. But you started rapping when? Like, in high school? Like, when I was four or five. Damn, four or five? Mm-hmm. Crazy. Do you fight, too? Fight? Yeah. What do you mean? Because your pop's a fighter. I mean, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Man, I started doing music around eight, and normally people are like, damn, eight, but four is crazy. Yeah. What'd y'all get me from Chick fil A? Know, right? What happened to Texas Hospitality? What happened? Oh, that was quick, huh? That was, that was, a, crazy, was a quick turnaround. Right. That was a quick turnaround. I'll take back we all my early I'm, compliments. We, Love. Pleasure, baby. Thank you for coming, bro. Yeah, of course. Appreciate yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. I feel safe for people from Texas to here. It always makes me feel, I feel comfortable. Yeah. We didn't even <laughs> ask, bro, if he wanted something. That's rude That's as fuck. That's crazy. We need a Whataburger out here. Oh, you guys definitely it's do. It's time for that. Whataburger started where he's from. Where? Corpus. Oh, Corpus. There's a two story one over there. It's a two story. On it's the, the double decker. On the beach. Damn. On the beach. It's the double decker Whataburger on the beach. Oh, yeah, on the beach. Fucking lit. <laughs> and now, for your enjoyment, weed talk with Kenny Beats and that Mexican OT. Do you all roll joints like that in Texas? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's a lot. Are you judging me? I'm, I would never judge Are you. you. Judging I, would, me? I would never judge They're you. They're but... hooties. Hooties. <laughs> Little donkey dick. <laughs> Bruh. That's gotta be three grams. About an eighth. How many? How many of those? When well, I mean, you're smoking, when it's like you just comfortable and you got them rolled, how many are you gonna put down in a day of those? Oh shit! Ten? <laughs> are we putting down ten of them a day? We're putting down a zip a day? Yeah. Easily. Uh, when I was 25, I wasn't far off, but now, now at my age, at 32 years old, bro, I've been hitting wax lately too. So like now it's probably like five and some wax. Isn't it crazy how wax just disappeared? Yeah. This See, shit is gonna blow your mind, bro. I'm just. A, <laughs> Corn syrup. Look at the consistency of it. That shit sh like shattered. It smells like like, like gum powder and like oranges. <laughs> or some shit. Jesus Christ! If you I, hit that, you are gonna walk off scratching your ass. <laughs> <laughs> no bullshit. I was smoking <laughs> wax when it was like wasn't ready yet. So like people had just started dabbing. It just started becoming the thing. But like. You would go to places, especially in Texas, yeah, you go to places more. in the South, the people would be like, oh, you want to hit some wax? And it would be black. Oh. Like it was not clean. You'd be hitting at an old rig with a metal yeah, nail on it. I already it. know what you're talking about. Bro, I like, was just saying, yeah, I was that way. And I remember I was in a hotel one time. The most fucked up I ever was in my life was off no other drug. It was off wax. I had like a bad, butane out dab. Ooh. I called my mom in the hotel room and was like, mom, if I don't call you in nine hours, I'm dead. You gotta do something. Oh but shit. At this point, I had already tripped. I had already been through so much drug experience and that was the worst thing I ever went through. So when people Damn. like- Worse than the psychedelic trip? Worse than anything bad I ever went through. So when people are like, man, I, I don't fuck with weed or weed gets me paranoid or whatever, I, I take them dead serious. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I never found it funny to be like, oh, let me get somebody way too hot because I know oh. that's, that's worse than anything else. Yeah, Can I be. had this motherfucker hit some wax one time and he was like, in my living room like this <laughs> pale uh -huh. like this he was like he was he was shaking pale like I'm talking about full on lost his color like, bro. and started and started sweating saying he was cold <laughs> oh, oh my god I was in Denver I took a dab in Denver and the nail it was like a nail on there and I was going like this I knocked the nail off of 
the rig and it fell into this dude's couch and just burnt melt straight oh, into yeah. it. But they were fans, so they were like, oh, it's all good, bro. But I could tell it was like, Damn, I just dude. caused like a $400 problem. You yeah. know what I mean? Hey, uh, shout out to Mason, bro. My fault. That's him? Mason, man. He's a good kid. Yes, yeah, Shout out Mason, man. <laughs> what is this? Uh, it's like some armpit shit, man. It's some fire, bro. I got it from uh, Dope as Usual. But it's like, armpit? Like, I'm talking about the smell on it. Like, it's like an OG. It's it's definitely an OG, you know what I'm saying? But that's why I say like that. See how he smells it? Yeah, arm, <laughs> underarm <laughs> could. OG's yeah. coming back. But look, kind of. I'm still a big fan of that candy. Don't get it twisted. I yeah. like that candy. My favorite weed in the world is always going to be uh, Skittles. Forever. I tried some uh, I tried some Fruit Loops one time. This was like 2019, 2020. Man, that shit tastes just like fucking Fruit Loops. I smoked that shit out of a Swisher at the time. Imagine if I smoked it out of a paper. Anything else? Yeah. Sw Swisher's damn <laughs> That's cardboard. That's crazy, bro. Listen to me, we from the South, cousin. Hey, keep smoking cardboard if you want to. I don't know what you want to say. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone always says the same thing. It's, it tastes like cardboard. But, but on the East Coast, like... It's better than 4Ks. Yeah, I mean, bro, look, look at that ad right there. That's that's my face on the Dutch Master ad campaign that was in grocery stores. People Are you first, shitting me? Bro, I was in every single East Coast like mobile station you can imagine on that ad. So what am I? A guy like my self supposed to how many minutes was that? Nine. Come on! Motherfucker, baby. They think it's a game, bro. You a bad motherfucker, baby. I shouldn't be this amazed at this point. <laughs> I was like, yo. My job here is done. Come on, man. You finna see what I'm talking about. I'm trying to, you know. Are you ready? You ready? I don't even, even want to say nothing. You're just going to see what I'm going to do. Look, everybody right here, check this out. Come here. Put the camera on me. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to do this. And then whenever I take the phone away, it's all going to be ready. I'm just going to practice running. I'm just practice running right now. Yeah. Come on, baby. Come here. Come talk to me. Hey, yo. Is that that man? Hey, kid. Yeah. You are not alive. With that mix, no tea. You see what I'm Hey, hey, look. So what am I? Her guy, like my self, supposed to do? Huh? Without his oxygen. Hey, what am I? Yeah, her guy, like my self, supposed to do? Huh? Without his oxygen. Hey. Baby, my baby, baby, she love me all the time. <laughs> baby, my baby, baby, she run through on my mind. I know you tired. Tighten up on them range, you running wild. Oh, she running wild. Take her to the bedroom and we fucking lie. We love fucking. Yeah, she say that she trust me, cause I turn nothing into something. I got three pot of girls in bed, believe all of them be puffing. Could tell my baby just want some dick, cause all day she be fussing. I got a whole lot of dick full of shorty, you wanna get it, wouldn't get up and get it. I put the pussy on the plate and dig it. She got me deep up in the pussy like giggity, break it down. Build it up, cause I can do that. Money on my mind all the time, look like it's a do rag. Jesus. Mark, one take Jake. One, one take, take Jake. Jake. Come out the booth, bro. <laughs> one take Jake, baby. <laughs> Damn, you weren't lying. Dog, man, I'm telling you, first time, bro. the way you work, the way he work. <laughs> like that, that, huh, man? This might, we might be moving too fast. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Even to, like, take it down a notch. Come on, man. Tighten up on them ways, you running wild. Oh, she running wild. Bro, take it to the baby, man. I kind of knew this was going to go like this, but it went better than I could have expected. Of course, of course, bro. And we actually did it in time matter. I'm saying. Oh, no. Wow, you fresh yeah, yeah. to death. What's hey, can up, we baby? play? Can we play for fee real quick? We're gonna play for fee right now. Yeah. Say bye to the people real quick. And we're hey, out. deuces, man. Love y'all, bro. <laughs> hey, I need y'all to be ready, man. Let's go. Hell yeah. Woo!